Not only did they help me fix the car, they threw in a bonus. Special this week only. It's like an onboard radar for you guys. Picks up little beacon jobbers like this one here. We've hidden a bunch of these things out there in the field to signal emergency stashes. So keep an eye out. When you see your dashboard light up, you're gonna want to stop and investigate. I'll fill you in on the road, Gordon. Thanks again, you guys. going off, Gordon. Now, why would the Combine put a roadblock way out here?
They're talking about us. They're still after the data packet. Send more. Well, let's find the power supply for this force field. There's the power source for the shields. Huh. They haven't skimped on security either. Let me see if I can disable the shields and get you closer to the reactor. Okay, it looks like I can open them from here, but I won't be able to come in with you. Here goes. <sighs> Sorry, Gordon. This thing's fried. Since I can't help you in there, why don't I stand watch outside while you disable the power cell? We've had enough surprises for one day.
Let's hope there's no more combine between here and Wide Forest. enough to make it the rest of the way on foot if we have to. Whoa, a dropship. That must have been the crash we heard. White four sentries are doing their job. What the hell? A strider! Over here, boy! Wait, it sounds like... Then head up the other side. White Forest is right there. You can't miss it. All right. Thanks. Okay, let's go. Come on, Gordon. Get the car. Good boy. Looks like we need your help again. Would you mind? Way to go, boy! 
boy. Okay, dog. Race you to the base. <laughs> Step on it, Gordon. saw a dog take off like that. I was never so glad to see him, believe me. Well, Gordon, White Forest, we made it. Safe at last. We better hurry up. Magnuson will lose it if he thinks we're fooling around. Hello, Dr. Freeman. Well, Gordon Freeman. And about time, too. Dr. Freeman, you made it. Hey! Boy, are we glad to be here. Yeah, we heard you ran into a little trouble out there. The Combine's been trying to hit in the front door. <laughs> I think they learned their lesson. You mind if we, uh, keep Dog patrolling out here? <laughs> not at all. You heard him, Dog. I'm gonna go see Dad. I'll catch up to you later. You take care of yourself. I don't think Eli knows you're here yet. He's in silo one access unit, right through here. Shall we? You smell it? I don't feel anything anymore. <laughs> you and me both. What now? This oh no, what's that? Well, now what? Pretty sure this was... All right, back to work, everyone. It's just another false alarm in the okay, secondary dog. silo. Let's take a walk. Same old Dr. Magnuson. So, have you ever used an AR-2 before? AR-2? No. Now, an AR-3, sure. Plenty of times. There is no such thing as an AR-3. Well, see, in the city, the place was lousy with AR-3s. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. No, it was So, do you know what the alternative fire method does on the AR-2? It kills hunters. How did you city folk kill hunters? We sure as hell didn't use guns. We would just wrestle hunters to the ground with our bare hands. I used to kill 10, 20 a day, just using my fists. Oh, so when you're out in the field, you're gonna be punching hunters? In the field? I'm not going out in the field. I'm a radio operator. Uh, that's it. Leave. You don't need to be here, and I'm not gonna continue the lesson until you leave. I'm staying right here. I am serious. Leave. I'm not going to continue until you leave. <laughs> 